Hello, and welcome back to Species Spotlight. This week, we are going to learn about a duck that is arguably the most stunning in North America, the wood duck. Wood ducks are commonly seen throughout the United States and southern parts of Canada, with larger populations along the east coast from Nova Scotia to Florida. They can be found in a variety of habitats, including ponds, lakes, marshes, swamps, and along rivers and streams. Wood ducks normally prefer areas that have vegetation coverage and tend to shy away from open bodies of water. Wood duck males, or drakes, have a very distinct breeding plumage. Their head and crest are greenish purple, outlined with white lines, while their throat and neck are also white. The drake's breast is a chestnut brown color with white spots fading to a tannish white on their belly. Their wings are black and metallic blue, and one of the drake's most distinctive features are their red eyes and reddish-orange bill with a black tip. The females, or hens, are also very striking for a dull-colored bird. Hens are mostly brownish-olive, with white streaks on the breast. They have dark eyes with a teardrop-shaped white eye ring and a dark gray bill. The legs and feet are dark yellow, just like the drake's. Wood ducks are about 19 inches in length and have a wingspan of about 2.5 to 3 feet. On average, wood ducks live for around 4 years in the wild. However, the oldest recorded wood duck was aged at 22 years old. Wood ducks feed by dabbling while swimming around or through very short, shallow dives. Their diet alters throughout their lives. As juveniles, wood ducks will eat a variety of invertebrates, small fish, and even tadpoles. As they mature, the adult's diet will mostly become vegetarian, including seeds, nuts, and plant matter. Wood ducks pair up in late winter and begin breeding in early spring. After the pair breeds, they build a nest in the cavity of a tree, usually one that hangs over water or is close by to a water source. If a tree cavity is not available, the wood ducks will also utilize nest boxes built by people that are normally found along the edges of lakes or ponds. Females will lay approximately 6 to 15 eggs, but if another female cannot find a nest of her own, she may lay eggs inside of another wood duck's nest. Sometimes, one nest can hold up to 40 different eggs from multiple females. After hatching, the ducklings are born with feathers and leave the nest quickly. If the female nested in a tree cavity, the ducklings must jump down from the nest tree and make their way to the water. The mother calls them to her, but does not help them in any way. Ducklings may jump from heights of over 50 feet without injury. The wood duck ducklings will then be raised on the water. While observing wood ducks is a bit more difficult than observing other waterfowl, some parks that have wood duck nest boxes include Crystal Lake, Boundary Creek, and Pennington Park. As winter approaches, take a look around the nest box areas to see if you can find any signs of wood ducks. Thanks for tuning in to this week's Species Spotlight.